Welcome back to the Red Carpet Reup. Today we're diving into the recent courtside drama between Drake and NBA star DeMar DeRozan. It all went down during a game between the Toronto Raptors and Sacramento Kings, where Drake, as usual, was supporting his hometown team and made his opinions on DeRozan crystal clear. But DeRozan didn't let Drake's comments slide and had a clever response of his own. Let's break down what happened, why DeRozan's loyalty to Kendrick Lamar came up, and what this says about Drake and DeRozan's relationship. So, let's set the scene. During the Raptors-Kings game, Drake, a longtime Raptors fan and team ambassador, sat courtside, ready to cheer for Toronto. As the game got intense, Drake zeroed in on DeRozan, who had played for the Raptors for many years, but now represents the Kings. Throughout the game, Drake tossed out some taunts. even calling DeRozan a goof and promising that he'd tear down any banner put up in DeRozan's honor. Yes, if you ever put a, a DeRozan banner up, I'll go up there and pull it down myself. That's the answer to the question. And when DeRozan missed a game-tying shot, Drake didn't hold back, mouthing some unfiltered words. It wasn't the first time Drake has shown his competitive spirit. But this time, it got personal. After the game, DeRozan was asked about Drake's comments. In his usual cool style, DeRozan laughed it off, telling reporters that if Drake wanted to pull down a banner, he'd have a long way to climb. I'll go up there and put it down myself. What's your reaction to that? Well, you gotta, you gonna have a long way to climb. Take it down. <laughs> Thanks, everyone. He also posted a funny clip on his Instagram from the movie Friday, hinting that Drake might just be tough when DeRozan's back is turned. This wasn't the end of it, though. Ass damn. Man, I got mind control over Debo. He be like, shut the fuck up. I be quiet. But when he leave, I be talking again. DeRozan explained his strong loyalty to Kendrick Lamar, who's a fellow Compton native. In an interview with The Breakfast Club, he emphasized that his roots in Compton come first, even though he has love for Toronto and Drake as well. DeRozan admitted he hasn't spoken to Drake since his feud with Kendrick started earlier this year, hinting that things might be a bit tense. But DeRozan's loyalty to his Compton roots, and by extension Kendrick, is clear. Kendrick Lamar has shown his support for DeRozan too. In Kendrick's recent diss track, he even name drops DeRozan, saying he's glad DeRozan came home after leaving Toronto. The two share a deep connection to their hometown and pride in Compton, which is something DeRozan says he values deeply. This adds an interesting layer to the drama, as Drake has been publicly at odds with Kendrick Lamar for a while. For DeRozan, it's less about choosing sides and more about staying loyal to his roots. Drake's courtside rivalry with DeRozan gave fans a glimpse into some friendly yet competitive drama. For DeRozan, loyalty to his hometown of Compton and respect for Kendrick Lamar is non-negotiable, even if Toronto and Drake hold a special place in his career. It's all love, but also a reminder that when it comes to sports and music, hometown pride runs deep. What do you guys think? Was Drake just being playful or did he cross the line? And how do you feel about DeRozan's loyalty to Kendrick? Let us know in the comments. Thanks for watching the Red Carpet Reup. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more updates on the latest celebrity drama and music industry news. See you in the next one.